Adam with webstarts.com. In this short video, I'm going to show you how to add translation service to your website using WebStarts and another application called Weglot. Before I dive into the video, I'd like to invite you to tap the subscribe button and ring the notification bell. That way you'll be the first to find out when I release a new video on web design, internet marketing, search engine optimization, and similar topics. As you can see on my web page here in the bottom right, I have a tab and that tab says English because that's the pay, uh, language that I'm using for my page. When I tap that tab or click it and then select Spanish or Espanol, you can see that the content on my page is translated into Spanish. You can do that with multiple languages. So you can translate a single website into all kinds of languages. I'm going to show you how you can do that with Web Starts and an application called Weglot now. First thing you're going to need is a website that you build with Web Starts. You can do that by going to webstarts.com. You click on Get Started. It's free. And the next step, you choose a design for your website. All of the designs are 100% customizable and can be changed at any time. So you can't make a mistake by choosing wrong design. You can search for designs by their category and also by integration. For example, you can search for a design that has an online store or even a built-in blog. All right, for this demonstration, I'm just going to be choosing a design. And then once you've selected that design in the next step, you're gonna do the normal signup stuff. Like for example, enter your name, your email address, and choose a password. And then in the last step, what you're going to do is verify your phone number and choose a web address for your website. And I've already done that and I've signed up for an account. So I'm just going to log into my existing account by clicking log in and I'm going to pick back up from there. Once you're logged into your Web Starts account, you'll be greeted on the dashboard with a thumbnail to your website. And you can begin editing the pages of your website by clicking edit site. Now it's time to go to weglot.com and set up our very first translation engine. Just like with Web Starts, you're going to need to sign up for a weglot.com account before you can proceed. So be sure to go to weglot, W-E-G-L-O-T.com and sign up for an account. Once you get in, it's time to set up your first project. You can give your project a name, any name is just fine. Really doesn't matter. Next, you're going to select your website technology. I'm going to select the option for other and then click next. In the next step, you're going to skip down to where it says JavaScript integration. You're going to click use JavaScript integration, and that's going to allow you to skip a bunch of complicated steps. And then you're going to select the language you want your website to be in for starters, and then the languages that you want to translate to. Note that with the free version of weglot.com, it only lets you translate from one language to another. If you have a paid subscription, you can translate all from one language to all kinds of languages. I'm going to click next. And in this final step, I get this snippet of code. I'm going to copy it to my clipboard. I'm going to move back on over to my web starts website, click insert, choose HTML code, agree that I know what I'm doing. And then I'm going to click on view site head and I'm going to paste the code into the field provided click OK, and then click Save. All right, so I've now added the Weglot translation widget to my website, and I can view that by clicking View Site. You'll see it pop up down here in the bottom right-hand corner. And now I can have my site visitors select between viewing my site content in both Spanish and English. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to visit webstarts.com to create your very own free website and see more helpful videos like this.